Hi, I'm trying something I haven't done before. I'm gonna vlog my travel knitting, or I'm gonna vlog my knitting that I do while I'm traveling. And today is September the 13th, a Thursday, and I'm leaving for Italy for two weeks tomorrow on Friday the 14th. So I'll be there for two weeks with my mom and my son, and my dad and my brother are joining up uh, and his family are joining us for the first week. We'll be um, in the Rome area, northern side of Rome. I'm curious to actually document um, what I knit while I'm away. Sometimes I feel like I don't really do much knitting, but right now I've, I have a project that I'm really excited about and I know I will be working on that. So just to, to document how, what, where, when I knit when I'm traveling. And maybe a few um, views of Italy, the landscape in Italy as well, uh, for you to enjoy. But we'll keep it mostly to knitting as this is a knitting channel. Now, um, it's time to start packing or at least thinking about packing since I am leaving tomorrow. So I'm going to start with what knitters usually start with, thinking and deciding what knitting to bring with me. So let's go have a look. So here's the thing. I finished um, this just this morning. It's the first Memory Keepers hat. It's unblocked, just of my needles. But um, I knit this one, and as you can see, this is a rather large one. I like um, loose and sort of slouchy hats, so um, um, that's how I knit the first one. But I already know that I want to make this available in several sizes, as um, I want the whole family to be able to have Memory Keepers hats, mine and yours. Um, so. This will be the largest size and then there will be at least two smaller ones. So this one was so addictive to knit, I just really want to cast on for another one immediately. I still have some of this um, undyed natural fingering weight wool from Rinta Lantila. So I'm going to do that. And I had several color options for the first one. So I still have these that I could do. And um, my son really likes green, so I'm thinking I could knit him a green, green version or greenish version. So that might be the next one that I do. Um, I don't think I'll have enough of this for three hats. 100 grams gain won't be enough. Um, this one took about 50 grams. So. so for the second one, I could either go with this grayish one but I'm not sure if I have enough of it or I could go really crazy and do it uh, as the base color use this purple one but I'm gonna pack all of these with me um, I, I knit the hat with these circulars and then for the crown of course DPN so I'm gonna take those with me and I need stitch markers as well so but that's one or two projects that's quite a lot of yarn um, I'll pack some in my suitcase and the other ones for the carry-on luggage. But just in case, I actually do finish this pretty quickly, which I think might be the case. I'm taking this one. If you watched the previous episode where I did the whip audit, you know that this one contains um, another scrappy project. The advent calendar socks that I started last December. We've got the first one done and the second one is here and all the minis that it needs. So I'm going to pack this one uh, with me as well. So I think that's enough. I mean, if I was at home, it might not be enough for two weeks of knitting, but I will be traveling. So um, I might not have the energy or the time to knit that much. So I'm going to take those and hope that it's enough.
Italy. We're staying for the first week in this um, villa. It's not an old villa, it's um, quite new actually, I think. But um, the views here are gorgeous. And it's near Sperlonga, which is about an hour and a half, two hours um, north, I'm sorry, south of Rome. Today's Monday, uh, September 17th. Um, the weekend was spent exploring the area near here and today I've done some work and the others um, went to the beach and then tomorrow we're heading to Pompeii which has been on my bucket list of places to visit um, since since I first heard about or learned about um, the place so I'm really looking forward to that now I'm just relaxing and doing some knitting. I'm back home. Today is Monday, the 1st of October, and I got home on a Friday. And you'll have just seen my knitting during my trip to Italy and a few bits and bobs from, from where I was. I didn't do any filming and I didn't do any knitting in Rome, but my mom did. Um, she cast on for Carade and put a few stitches in here and there, including the Colosseum. She hasn't knit lace in a long time, so I'm really um, looking forward to seeing the shawl grow. But yeah, the thing that I did knit from start to finish is the second Memory Keepers hat. I'm both a bit disappointed that that's all I did, considering how much I packed. I would have liked to have put in a few rows on the rounds on the socks or at least started the third hat but also this the one hat is more than I've knit um, on my previous trips in the past few years so 
pretty much what I expected. But yeah, um, the trip was amazing. We saw so much and um, during the evenings I didn't really have energy to knit. I just read a bit before going to bed, but I did knit on the plane rides, um, train rides, car rides. So that's when I did my knitting. So thank you for um, watching. I hope you enjoyed this um, a bit different video and I will see you in my next video. Thank you. Bye.